Hello brothers and sisters in Christ. I've got a short video for you today that uh, might, might be very important to some of you. It is Saturday, January the 16th, and it's 8.59 a.m. And these are just a couple of recalls that could very well affect your health. All right, this first one is Hot Pockets. Does anybody like those Hot Pockets? Maybe not you, but maybe your children. All right, it says Hot Pockets Recall. Nestle recalls nearly 763,000 pounds due to possible glass and plastic contamination. Now, that's, that's no joke. You don't want your child or yourself swallowing glass or plastic. It can perforate your intestines. All right, this was put out by USA Today, and the article was written by Kelly Tycho. I'm only going to read a little bit and leave a link in the description box. You can get to it by going to usatoday.com and then type in Hot Pockets Recall and it'll pull it up, I'm sure. Nestle Prepared Foods is recalling about 762,615 pounds of pepperoni pizza Hot Pockets. See, that's my favorite kind. I used to eat those, but uh, not for very long. <laughs> the U.S. Department of Agriculture's Food Safety and Inspection Service announced late Friday. All right, the frozen stuffed sandwiches, which were shipped to stores nationwide and produced in November are being recalled because they, quote, may be contaminated with extraneous materials, specifically pieces of glass and hard plastic, unquote, according to a news release. And this is classified as a Class 1 recall. So it is important check your freezers. If you have any, throw them out or if you know where you got them, um, then go get your money back. Now, on this same article, it's mentioning another product that I wasn't able to mention before. Uh, dog food recall expands. More than 70 dogs have died and 80 pets sick after eating sports mix pet food. My online vet that I like, um, what's his name? He's got a YouTube channel. He shows you all kinds of stuff, recipes to cook for your dog, all kinds of things. But anyway, he had mentioned this in the online newsletter I get from him. So, this is a link. You have to click on it. Christopher and Banks store closing sales. Oh, y'all really want to know about that. All locations liquidating after retailer files for bankruptcy protection. And that's all I have to say about that. So, you go to usatoday.com and put in... Nestle recalls, or well, you can just put Hot Pockets recall by Nestle and or just the first three words, whatever. And that, that should pull it up by Kelly Tycho, T-Y-K-O. And it was put up January 16th, okay? So it is very, very recent. All right, now this one. Uh, okay, I guess that's ads. Heightened security in and around Capitol Complex. It's talking about the thing that's going to happen at the Capitol. Uh, but the article is about Weiss Markets. Or Weiss, I'm not sure how to say that. It's W-E-I-S. Markets issues recall for possible contamination 
in their ice cream product. Aw, there's Kamala. No, sorry it was not. That was a pretty lady. I was going to say she's such a pretty lady, but it wasn't. She was a news broadcaster. She really looked to me like Kamala. Anyway, I have a theory about her, Kamala. She may be our next president, but only for a brief time. And then Obama comes back to play. That's... That's just uh, my opinion for now. All right. So anyway, back to the ice cream by Kate Swigert. Posted January 14th. I don't know if any of you buy Weiss ice cream, but if you do, check your freezers and see if you have any of this. The Weiss Markets has issued a recall for possible foreign matter. What is up with this? Contamination and nearly 11,000 containers of Weiss quality cookies and cream ice cream. So there you have it, cookies and cream. According to the supermarket chain, the ice cream containers may be contaminated with metal filling equipment parts. Now how in the world does that happen? Metal filling. It does say filling. F-I-L-L-I-N-G. Metal filling. Equipment parts. There has been one report of a customer who discovered an intact piece of metal equipment in the Weiss Quality Cookies and Cream Ice Cream 48 ounce. The Weiss statement read there's also a concern of additional foreign material in the product that could present a choking hazard it says it was sold in 197 locations although it's been removed from the Weiss freezers including ones in Pennsylvania Maryland and New Jersey okay so you might want to go read the rest of that and it's um, I'll put the link but it's at abc27.com and put in type in Weiss markets recall for ice cream all right and that's the end of this one and I will talk to you later